It's a great day for a drive, especially in a 2024 Bronco Outer Banks in Velocity Blue. It has gray and black interior with leather trim seats, seating for five, four doors, and a swing gate. It has a 2.3 liter EcoBoost engine paired with a 10 speed automatic transmission, and it's a 4x4. You also have navigation, reverse camera, and many other features. If you'd like to take this vehicle out on a test drive, you can book it online at islandford.ca. Stay tuned, we're going to have a look under the hood and inside and out. This is a 2.3 liter EcoBoost engine paired with an automatic transmission and 4x4. Let's have a look inside. Storage in the door and you also have your locks. And the driver's seat is powered with lumbar, all weather mats on the floor. And you have your hood release, electronic parking brake, LED side view mirror spotlights and your lighting controls. There's a grab handle right in the body here and a running board and that just makes it easier to get in. On the face of the steering wheels are lane keeping and cruise control as well as volume. We have our menu and hands-free dialing. And this is a push start. So my foot's on the brake, keys in the pocket, and we're gonna push the engine start stop button. Your menu's gonna come up, any important messages and your odometer reading. In the center here, we have trail turn assist. So what that does is it locks the rear driver wheel, giving you a pivoting point, and it gives you traction on the rear passenger wheels. This allows you to do donuts or even a tight corner if you need to, and that would be on soft surfaces like gravel, sand, um, that kind of thing. You're not going to do it on asphalt. This is traction control hazard lights. We've got the nice big screen, the little mini menu on the side. We can go into our sources, AM, FM, Sirius Satellite Radio, as well as Bluetooth. And then we can go into navigation. You're going to see that map come up, choose your destination. We've got our settings. We can slide through there, different options. You can change the look of the display screen. And in your features, you're going to find your owner's manual, zone lighting, and driver assistance. Also, when we put the vehicle in reverse, this is where we see the backup camera view. So you've got where we are in space and then the green, yellow, red, just how close we are to other objects or vehicles and your center line located right there. So let's put us back into park. Park. You've got your volume and tuner, auto stop start for less idle time, your parking sensors, and as well you've got your forward camera. So this is just showing you what's ahead, you're not in gear, you're just having a quick peek and here you are in space again. So let's get out of there. Dual climate control and it's digitally noted on both sides. Heated seats for both driver and passenger as well as a heated steering wheel. And then you've got your fan in the center, your front and rear defrost, AC and max AC. And then down below, we have a little cubby as well as your USB-C and USB automatic select shifter. And you have your 4x4 hill descent as well as goat modes goes over any train. So as we dial through, you're going to see that appear. Look at the very left. You can see the line normal. And the icons are going to change. Eco, sport, slippery, mud ruts, and sand. And so these are giving you more or less traction as needed, depending on the weather, depending on the road conditions, how you're driving, what you're doing. A couple of cup holders. Your window controls are located here and so are your mirrors. And that is because your doors come off. Now your mirrors are attached to the car, so, or the vehicle. So when you take the doors off, you still got your side view mirrors, which is genius. I think. And then you've got your grab handle in the body for the passenger auto dimming rear view mirror. Your lighting controls are up here. I keep pushing on the light instead of the button. There you go. Universal garage door opener. And you also have upfitter switches. So if you wanted to add winches or lighting or whatever, you've got that already there. You've got a hard top with the sound deadening liner. So that'll enhance your acoustics, but it also, obviously when the, everything's, the doors and the top are on, and it also uh, cuts down on the road noise as well. But they do come off and you can store them in the back if you want. 18 inch wheels, black running boards, body color door handle with intelligent access. That means when the fob's in close proximity, you can lock and unlock the doors and driver's side capless easy fuel gas filler. In the rear, it, the rear handle also has intelligent access and you have a windshield wiper, backup camera in the center of your spare tire and backup sensors as well as a tow, hole, tow hook. And then when you're ready to open it up, this is a swing gate. So just pull the handle and it's nice, opens nice and large so that you can get bigger items in and the glass pops up. And then off to the side is a 12 volt as well as lighting. You've got a storage bag for your two panels in the roof that come off and you've got extra carpeted mats and this nice all weather mat as well. Makes for easy cleanup. You also have hooks and tabs to be able to tether things and then bring the glass down, swing it closed. You can then lock it up and walk away or jump in and head out on your latest adventure. And on your fob, you have remote start.
storage in the door and grab handle in the body. They're sitting for three with a 60-40 split. You can bring down the headrest by pushing the button and then pull the tab and the seat will go right down. You have a nice all-weather mat under here. There's extra carpeted mats and a storage bag because your roof comes off in the front two panels store in there. You also have anchors on the back of the seat and then just give it a push back into the upright position and flip up your headrest. In the center is an armrest with a couple of cup holders, all-weather mats on the floor and slim pockets on the back of the front seat. In the center you've got your window controls because your doors come off and it also reminds you that the center portion is not a step and you have 110 volt and then grab handle on the passenger side and dome lighting in the back. Spare tire, reverse camera and windshield wiper in the rear, privacy glass in the back windows and you have the hard top molded in color that has the sound deadening headliner so it enhances the acoustic when it's on and it reduces the road noise and you have your blind spot information in your side view mirrors halogen headlights fog lights tow hooks and so many more reasons to visit us if you like this video and would like to see more please subscribe we have plenty to share with you and we'd love to hear your comments